Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. For those who don't know, my name is Amber. I do, I guess I'm gonna post whatever I want in this channel eventually, but right now it's concentrating on OMAD videos and recipes and whatnot. So right now I'm kind of in a different place. I'm currently at Target because I needed a few items and I was like, eventually I wanna start doing like travel vlogging. So I should probably practice, you know, vlogging in public so it's so nerve-wracking like having your camera out especially since the area i live in not many people do that i live in a very older people area so it's just usually a lot of seniors walking around and they like to stare and they like to talk so i'm gonna test it out just going around showing you guys what i'm getting you know getting a feel of vlogging in public and oh also i did my nails and three of them already popped out but you can't really see them so i guess it doesn't really matter i took a little break i still work at nine i guess you call it nine to five i really i work a six to five six a.m to five p.m so i work really long shifts and i was just tired and i didn't feel like editing so i haven't released a video and i'm sorry but i'm back so yeah and also i wasn't really happy with my filming style i wanted to try something different but I know how to try something different so while here at target i'm also going to be picking up a few items to like better my house i guess yeah to make my videos better like i want to get new plates because i think new plates would make everything so pretty and i want to get a ring light because a lot of my videos are really dark because the way my kitchen is set up it's really bright when the sun's out but the, my lights some of them don't work like the one above the stove doesn't work so i wanted to get a ring light so that you could actually see what i'm cooking towards night and i wanted to just get better with my editing and everything so i've been brainstorming some ideas and even though i took a break from making videos i didn't take a break from my diet so i am still working out eating right and all that stuff I've, i'm essentially fueling my shopping addiction that's really what i'm doing i'm just here to feel my shopping addiction my brother's birthday is today well by the time you're seeing it it won't be my brother's birthday anymore last time i went to his house he didn't have any pots <laughs> he had like he had pots and pans he didn't have a lot of them so i wanted to see if there was like a cheap pot set that i can get him because he just bought a house so i want to like i guess i could give it as a birthday gift slash um what is it called homecoming yeah, my, my nails are horrible. I really, I'm gonna fix these. these I, they're just press on. I'll fix them when I get home. Yeah, I just wanna get him like a cheap pot set or something. If I can find something. I'm in Target, so there's probably nothing cheap in there. That's what I'm about to do. I'm gonna put this hat on because I didn't secure this wig down. I didn't feel like securing the wig down and I need extra security so my wig doesn't pop off. So that's what I'm going to do. This is the cheapest, but five pieces. This is not that. Maybe it's that. Yeah, made by design. MD, BD, made by design. That's not enough pots. That's basically what he has now. These are kind of expensive. Maybe I should just go to Walmart and get him some pots. I don't feel like it's enough for what they offer. Yeah, we'll just go to Walmart. Oh wait, I went to another aisle. This one's better. I like the price of it. I feel like I've seen this set for $60. They have big lots though, so I'll probably go check there. Actually, I don't think I live near big lots. This one but I don't see it in white and I also only want one plate so it's too many so Target was kind of a bust I didn't get the things I wanted and instead I got a bunch of things I did not need Oof. my hands are there's one everywhere there I well I did need one thing, but I got this I got this spin brush oh can you see it spin brush thing because my other one broke I kept buying them from Vanity Planet they would always break so I was like might as well just buy it from like Target or something 
and this one seems to actually be rechargeable so it was a little it actually it was cheaper than the ones i buy from vanity Plant, so love that i also got this little false scare thing because i want to try to do my own lashes i usually just use falsies and right now i'm looking very naked mole ready i want to try to do them myself so that's what i'm going to do i'm going to try to go to at home because i live by at home and see if maybe they have the plates that I'm thinking of. And we'll see. I also didn't find the pots I wanted for my brother. There were some pots in there. But I was thinking around like the $60 range. And none of those were $60. So, yeah. Those. It's, it's a no. It's a no. So, I'm just going to go to at home and then try again. Alright. Made it to at home. So, hopefully they have the plates I want. I know they're not going to have the this set because at home it's like it's kind of like what's that plate home goods where i don't think it really sells like uh sets of anything it kind of just sells everything separately so you can just pick it up so hopefully they have the dish set i want i need to hide my other stuff and then i'll come back when i get back in time or i'll i'll probably take a tip in there yeah videotape <laughs> i'm showing my age i'll probably record in there the little things i see because it's at home it's always empty it's in the middle of nowhere i mean it's just very empty here there's no one ever over here yeah hopefully they have the stuff i need so we'll see so this is the kind of bowl i'm looking for but like this one's huge i need it like in place that's like so big size there's only two people in the house i don't need something that big how much is this? Mm, no, I'm not spending $30 on that. This is cute. I've always wanted like a wood bowl like this. Is that glitter in it? I don't think that's safe. I don't need this, but I kind of low-key want this. Unfortunately, at home was also a bus i'm looking for like a really specific plate it's like it's, it's a dinner plate but it has like sides to it so it's like a really really shallow bowl and that's what i'm looking for and they had something similar to that in there but it was too too big it wasn't dinner plate size it was like serving size so i didn't really want to use that so i guess i'll just order it off amazon which is gonna take a while and which means i have to order like a whole set but i mean I can't find it in the store, so kind of gotta do what I gotta do. I get, I'm about to get home, go home, and get ready to drive to South Carolina to go meet my family. It's like a two-ish hour drive, two and a half hours, three depending on traffic. So yeah, I'm gonna go do that. Meet my brothers. I don't know if all my brothers are gonna be there. It's been like ten years since all my brothers and me have been in the same spot together. So I don't think they're all going to be there, but I guess the majority of us will be there. My mom's not going to be there because she has a work today. So, and my dad, he's not going to go without my mom. So I don't really know what's the plan. No one's really telling me anything either. So, yeah, I'm going to go home, I guess, do something to my face, give myself some eyelashes or something, and then go from there. So, yeah, I guess I'll talk to you guys later. So since I was thinking about this false scare thing, I kind of want to try it out. And I was like, might as well just try it out on camera. It comes with these really cute tweezers. You can you? Why is it not focusing? It says they say kiss on them, but they're so cute. I love that. I guess I should do it in camera so you can like see. I'm scared to do this. I don't know why I'm scared. But I feel like glues my eye, my eyeball shut. Do I just do I push it all over? Am I putting enough? I can't even tell if I'm putting enough. How fast is it dry? It says to just you just place it under. It's not sticking. Am I doing this right? Through some sections, I probably should have. <laughs> I probably should have watched the video. Oh, I put the wrong one on. I put seal on. I'm supposed to put bond on. Oh, what do I do now? 
I mean, I did read the instructions, but I didn't, <laughs> I didn't know. And I don't feel like going upstairs to get a cotton pad, so we're just gonna. Oh, oh that was too much. Let's do that. I think that looks good. Okay, I'm doing something. Yeah, I got something, something going on here. It's stuck to the thing now. What a bunch of liars. It said squeeze it. I did squeeze it. Mary, I'm scared to touch it now. I feel like it's gonna come off. I'm gonna use my fingers because I'm kinda scared that I'm gonna rip out eyelash if I use my uh, tweezer thing. They're on there. They look pretty good. I think I think they look good. And now we're gonna put the sealant on. I'm not sure how I'm supposed to apply this. Am I applying this right? I feel like nothing comes up on this brush. They're so hard. I definitely should have removed my contacts for this. They're just gonna get everywhere. It's gonna, it's gonna glue to my eyeball. It's so good. See that this is it without, and this is it with it. I think it looks good. I don't like it. I don't love. I th and this is a lot cheaper than buying, doing the eyelash scent. I mean, yeah, it says it'll last 10 days. And eyelashes just last like a month, but this was like $24 and $24 for it to look like this. I mean, eyelash extensions, at least the ones I was going to get, are like, uh, I, I was about to spend $150 on them, give or take. Honestly, it probably would be closer to $200. Um, but yeah, I would say this is good for $24. I mean, it only costs $25. I got quite a few eyelashes. I think you can do at least two applications. It says that you can reuse them. We'll see in a couple days. I guess I'll update you guys next week when I, um, whether they last actually 10 days or not. We'll see. But I'm gonna go ahead and try to do the other eye. And now that I'm like an expert at this, right? I should be able to do this a lot better and faster than the other one. One hour later. I'm sure the more I do this, the better I will become. Because of right now, I am not the best at this. It's very subtle, and I like that. I don't really like the really big lashes. Like, uh, like, where it's basically like you have caterpillars on your, uh, Face. I'm not a fan of that. Mostly because uh, I did read that after a certain length, your eyelashes just start fluttering dirt right into your eye. And I wear contacts. I can't. I can't have dirt being fluttered into my eye. But I think they look great. I feel like I got some of the sealant on my eye. I can't. I can't tell the be I guess I'm gonna do. But I like them. I think they came out really good. This one's still acting a little weird, but I would say for the most part, this looks very natural. Sorry, my camera ran on the space there. I will update you guys in a few days how these hold up. I mean, right now they look good, but we'll see if they last as long as they say they do. I'll probably put this overnight thing on later after this dries a little. I'm not really sure how long it's supposed to dry for, but I'll put this on after it dries, but. Yeah, thank you guys for joining me on this uh, little mini quest thing, and I will see you guys next week. Bye.